Alrighty guys, welcome back. The Guru here. We're ready for a trap battle with the Orkin. This was a pretty decent game with the Orkin for me. It's slowly becoming one of my more favorite DDs. I, I can't really tell you why. It's just got this feel to it. And it's really, really starting to have a little bit of magic to it or something. I, I can't explain it. Uh, we do use legendary captains. What is it? Switz? I can't remember his name. It's the legendary uh, European captain, though. Swirsky. Yeah, Swirsky. I about call him Switzky. Swirsky. So we start out here normal. I think we're going to end up going to Sea Cap. Sea Cap looks like the place where I want to be. It's closest to where I started. It's got some pretty good cover. Now there is some flying squirrels also known as CVs in this game which make playing a no smoke DD kind of hard. It, if a CV wants to ruin your day it can just literally keep you lit up the entire time. The entire time which is really bad for when you're a CV because there's really no counter to it in a non-smoke DD if the CV really wants to bully you around and push you into that like there's not a lot you can do except for wiggle see I know there's something out that way oh changed a little bit behind me I do have radio location well those are kind of some preemptives I knew there was a ship out that way due to radio location. So we shot. I was assuming, and I'm pretty certain I assumed right, that I would not run into the DD that was in the cap just yet. Pretty certain I have the better guns here, so I'm like. Yeah. But we held off. I, I really wanted to engage the Minsk. I have no idea why. Oh, I couldn't hold it no longer. Shots fired. Shots fired. Shots fired at me. Boom! Get good, first blood. Get good, sir. He got gurued. Uh oh, scrubbing. Little scrubbings. Little bit of lovings. Okay, so we monstered it into the island. That was tactical beaching, that's all it was. It wasn't a misplay. The Kev's over in B. Saying somebody's spotting him. It could have been the CV, it could have been another DD, who knows. We're not really worried about B. We're worried about the sea cap which we haven't gotten yet turns out it was the Sashio that was spotting him on his way to see Sashio did not want to go 1v1 so did not. Well, I'm kind of licking chops over it I'm like ooh Sashio Assumed it's going to turn out. It turned out really quick, believe it or not. I'm not really sure that Sashio guy knew 
exactly how to play it. I think it was somebody that maybe just got it. Because they kept trying to hit. I'm pretty certain they was trying to hit me with Taurus. Oh. Calm down, Amalfi. Calm down. Anybody that's played the game knows that the Asashio has deep water torps. Can't touch other DDs. So, I don't know. Maybe they were scared torpedoes. Trying to scare us. All stations, reporting the position of a strategic target. Yes. I'm sitting here going, what in the world is spotting me? Uh oh. It's probably Benson. There we go. It's like, oh, let's lick and chop right here, guys. This is one place where I do know that I messed up. I should have pushed on in. And then radar, to be Fair, I'm not gonna lie, I have no idea how far the radar on this thing is. If I keep playing it, I'm gonna have to learn it. But I essentially wasted radar here. Didn't do anything. <laughs> I felt like crap. I was kinda a little agitated here. We still hadn't had C. I wasted the radar. I'm like, you know what, let's send some torps, see if we can't catch the Benson. While still trying to cap. New Orleans is playing a big DD. New Orleans is no more. I don't really know what the New Orleans was thinking, but he had he had some thoughts going through his head. At this point our team just went down on ships. I was like, no. So both the Vonkelin and the Mahong that went to A are dead. Man, they got blapperated over there. E blapperated. New word, guys. That's what happens in Wales sometimes. You get blapperated. Kind of a combo between evaporated and blapped. Evaporated. No, I'm spotted again. Oh, can they? Can they? Oh, come on. Oh. Oh, we only got one. No flood. What horrible luck. Horrible. Horrible luck. Oh, there's that stupid Asashio still floating around. You know he's probably licking chops at our bear. Our bear is just like... He's Asashio food at this point, probably, but... Oh, oh, my best up. I need my steering. Yeah, got what he said. What he said. Yeah, Masashio just. <laughs> oh, he blapperated her bear. Kind of what I figured. Oh. Got the fire on the Doria. Oh, and the crazy Joe kind of swooped in. We, I thought for sure I had kill number two. It is what it is. Good job, crazy Joe, on the kill secure. At this point, we brought it back even. Oh, fire. As soon as I did, I kind of regretted it. I'm like, well, you know, if I'm going down, I'm going to take out the Asashio. Then I realized how bad my shooting was. So I really would have thought that Amalfi, oh, it hurt, but not that bad. Would have done a little bit more damage than that. I'm like, oh, I'm still, uh, I forgot I just shot my main guns, so. though. 
I forgot about the main guns. Incoming! No, nope, missed me. Let's not shot at me. They thought they was better targets on the board. Maybe they were. Maybe they were. And then I'm really wanting to like burn, trying to burn out this QE. It's Queen Elizabeth, but I'm like, ah, oh, the stupid Amalfi's still there. And Amalfi with SAP is a DD's worst nightmare. And I'm like, why am I detected? Oh, there's the Asashio. Oh, pal, why? Why did you do it? Why did you do it? Get the second good. Down he goes. <gasps> oh, for a second I forgot myself. I was like, I'm about to poop my pants and I realized they was deep water torps. So they was scared torps after all. They was trying to skirt me. Did a pretty good job of it. Missed. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So we're only at 19k damage at the moment. But we're helping our team. You know, we've got all the caps. We're alive. We're holding off the other team. And we're, we're not, we're not playing stupid. Right here, I'm thinking. It's got 6k help. I set him on fire. I'm like, oh, he'll burn out. He's got 4,000 4, some hit points. So I switched up. I was really hoping that fire would stick. But uh, as you can see here in a little bit, you'll realize that I forgot that was British. He healed out of it. So, if Joe hadn't have took the Doria kill, we'd have been at three. And if I hadn't messed up on there, that would have been four on the QE. I mean, we'd been staring at a croc and pretty early in this match. But instead, we only have two kills. Look, he printed most of his ship back. Water biscuits. Oh, we got another fire on him. We got another fire. Flying squirrel, be gone. At this point, the CV's trying to kill me. And I'm like, you know what? I want to kill the CV. And this is another thing. I don't... I don't know. I thought it would die. It has two 2K hit points. So I'm like, you know what? I'm not... Not real worried. I I knew the Tylen had help, and he was shooting at it already. So I switched over to the battleships. I really wanted to hit the QE too. So right now I probably could have easily had a Kraken, uh, but I don't. We did get the Alabama. Send him back to Greenboro. So we got three kills. But the game ends. The game ends, guys. And here it is. Victory. Pretty good game. Only 37k damage. Uh, we were not really flagged up or anything. So. And then here you can see we ended up first place really good really solid orcing game so not too shabby uh left left i actually left a lot on the board but it is what it is so guys until next time get good hit the like and subscribe button there'll be more replays in the future have a good one peace out